Hello brothers and sisters, Assalamu alaikum, my name is Muhammad Ali and welcome to C Sharp Tutorials. This is tutorial number 5, so let's get started. Basically today we will be formatting our console and it will be really awesome. So let's get started. This is uh, 2013, I have 2010, but now I thought why not I use 2013. In the previous videos I have used 2010, okay? In the console application I would select, uh, let's say, uh, formatting. So, or designing console okay nice name but big doesn't matter because it's really good thing to give it a really detailed name so you can see what it is later if you don't understand what this program is about okay the first thing first uh, we're gonna say console dot read key and that's all so that we can stop the console from um, going away uh, after it has been run okay so first thing first if I say CW console.write line and I say LLT tutorials that would be the channel of mine and I'd say start well this works good but you see this thing in here this is called the title and this title sucks file uh, this is like colon or whatever this is colon so this really sucks so what I do is mostly what I do is uh, I always start with say starting uh, console formatting and I would always say ending com and or end of console formatting and after that I'll just start say console dot title and I'll say equal to LLT tutorials tutorial number five now you run this thing and you say how beautiful this looks okay so the previous one really looked bad but this re looks really good okay the, the second thing is we can change the colors we actually we are gonna change the colors we're gonna say console dot uh, background color equals console color dot let's say background color would be blue okay that's all so let's check it out and Oh, nothing happens. Why? Well, let's say something in here. We say console dot, let's say, read. And that's all. So what will happen, it's going to say first, it's going to read some characters. I ent click enter, it's going to wait for me to enter again. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to start. I'm going to say uh, it is LLC trials, no problem. It's because I asked it to put the title first. It's gonna put the title first. Secondly, I asked it to uh, write the title, uh, right line this LLT trails. It wrote LLT trails. Now I'm asking it to change the color, but the color would change now. You understand? Okay, so now it's color changing if I press anything. But why is that, uh, this happening? Okay, well, because this is getting overwritten. Okay, so the spaces in which nothing was written will remain as they were rest of the spaces okay if i change something the the background will change okay so we can change the foreground color we can say console dot foreground color equals console color dot let's say yellow i really like yellow and i really hate dark yellow okay now let's run it okay we have seen that uh, it works basically uh, back the background color changes now the text color also changes you see the difference that it is this is yellow and this is white you'll understand if you just write let's say you put red in here and let's try it again okay so the red color comes okay well this is good but you want the background to be white come on you want the background to be blue sorry so what can you do well basically you do all the formatting in the start and do your stuff that's why i have written 
start of formatting and end of formatting and as you can see control dot right line is not the start of something not, not the start of a it's not a part of start of a starting console formatting so it's not a part of uh, formatting well this will work if you just say console dot clear so what it will do it's gonna say I clear everything that is here okay now I do whatever I want so whatever is written right now will be uh, clear well you can do one thing else is because we are clearing everything at first it's gonna say okay you cleared everything so now whatever is be, uh, down will have these properties but if I take it down like this now it will what it'll do it will gonna say okay first thing I'm gonna bring the title second thing I'm gonna be uh, changing the background color third thing I'm gonna changing the front I'm gonna be changing the foreground color and lastly I'm gonna clear everything okay let's see okay now you can you see this uh, I hope you like this drill it was really uh, fun to make I mean come on this is really some of the fun tips uh, and the fun thing you do as a beginner in programming because you really sometimes need some fresh up so this was a fresh up tutorial for you guys okay thank you very much hope you like it and make sure to like subscribe and comment and make sure to watch all the videos thank you and bye bye